Hi guys. For dinner tonight, we had some beef jerky. I had some apple. Currently, I'm nibbling on nuts. Big Sam's thing of nuts. This canister is chocked full of nuts. Um, and it's a good mix. I mean, there's lots of pecans in it, and lots of Brazil nuts, and lots of um, hazelnuts, and or filberts. Some people call them filberts. Some hazelnut. Lots of good nuts. It's not just a bunch of peanuts and then a few of the other kind. It's a lot. And I'm not getting paid to say that. <laughs> so, nuts and beef jerky, a little beef jerky. Beef jerky is processed, so you shouldn't have a lot unless you make it yourself. But we were out and we hadn't, we had brunch. And so I got a bag of nuts, I mean a bag of beef jerky, small five ounce bag, four ounce bag. And Uncle Cece and I had to go to Sam's where they give out all these samples. So I just stuck a couple of pieces of beef jerky in my pocket and nibbled on that while we went through. And I got my big can of mixed nuts and some more apples, some more sausage, and we got some cheese wrapped pancetta pancetta wrap cheese. Uh, basically, I got that for easy something to put for Uncle Cece to carry to lunch. That's kind of easy, so I can cut up him a few wedges of that, and he's good for lunch. Excuse me. <laughs> we went looking for Vibrams. You know, the five finger toe shoes. I don't know why they call them five finger, because they're there should be five toe toe shoes, <laughs> but they call them five finger toe shoes, and um, we tried those on, and we ended up getting some. <laughs> These are the shoes, and let me tell you what, the opening here is not that big, so, and with my fingers, hmm. It has this little grabber thingy, but still. And I thought the shoes didn't fit me. I tried them and I went, oh, that's just, you know, it's too small a shoe. But I worked with it and got it on and the actual base of it is just perfect. They just need to get a little bit more room in here so you can get in. Because the shoe fits. And yeah, they're bizarre. They are really bizarre. They are ugly but they're supposed to help with your back uh, alignment because God made your feet perfect. So um, these bend and see, and um, a lot of runners or many runners use them. And um, eventually, hopefully, we'll uh, being to running or begin to run. It's, it's a long way off for me. Um, Part of the thing was move a lot and dart from time to time, just take off. And uh, I took off yesterday or the day before, and my hip is still killing me, my back. <laughs> so I'm, I'm not gonna do any um, darting anytime soon. <sighs> Quart jar, tea, mm. So that's that's what we did today. Just did a little running around and made a few stops, but we went Vibram shoe shopping. And we didn't really, I mean, we wanted them, but the first place we stopped, they, Uncle CC's, the only pair that would fit him in there were $150. And I looked at some and they were $100 and um, so we went to this place called Shoe Connection, um, and they were on sale for 54 
but we we got um, both got uh, shoes for what the price less than the price of what Uncle Cece's shoes would have cost at this other place so this other place isn't a big chain and it's a it's a, one of those places that if you really like status you say oh well I got them here I got them here yeah status heck I'm going for the price and uh, I'm gonna try to find the cheapest one so we looked for all the places uh, in our area that sold them and we ended up getting them at shoe connection so and I'm not getting paid for that one <laughs> either but um, yeah we were happy with them I, I we tried on every pair in the place and I wanted they're already Mimi is trying to get on top of me they're already you know strange ninja looking kind of shoes and they're you know people look at you look at your feet and I'm one of those people that likes to fade in the background but even even with this I'm not going to be able to fade in the background but I got the black ones because I just wanted you know maybe people not to pay so much attention um Uncle Cece got a gray and black mix. He really wanted straight black, but that's what he had to work with. So he's going to look for him on the internet and uh, make it him a black pair too. Um, but he's going to try out trying to walk on them. They're really, I mean, they kind of look like a foot and toes. But yeah, so um, we walked, we wore him out of the store and that was our second stop and so for the rest of the evening out we wore them and they're comfortable they're really comfortable I just have a problem getting them on and my hands are thumping they are really hurting and it's from putting those shoes on so my husband has a shoehorn a long one and uh, I'm gonna try with that and see if I can do it any easier. I gotta figure out something because I'll be deciding not to wear them because it hurts to put them on. It hurts my hands to put them on. So let's see. Um, yeah, it was a pretty easy day today. Um, from uh, we didn't leave here till one or two o'clock this evening, and. Um, so we had a brunch sausage patty I had one egg on top of mine my husband had two eggs and some cheese on top of his but you know it's bigger I did bigger than a I did about what you put on a kids hamburger that size you know about that size and um, it was um, that was good and that's all we had to eat until just about an hour ago when we had some beef jerky and some nuts and an apple. So anyway, we're doing good with it. We're doing really good. And I'm noticing differences. I'm noticing um, more energy, less lethargy, you know. I'm not as lethargic as normal I want to get out and do things and uh, our next thing are we're getting a bike rack for the car now we can go we can throw bikes in the back of the truck and take it and go riding that's for close but say we were going to my husband's families in Dallas or my family in Mississippi we're going to want to take our bikes with us because we're getting we're feeling energized so I'm like yeah and, and we go in the car because it has better gas mileage so yeah I want to I want to hook that up get get going you know what I mean so yeah we're we found a uh, car bike rack for um for the kia and uh it's a, it's about an hour away but no it's, it's a little less 
heck, it may be about an hour away. Um, our local one doesn't have it, but I'm thinking maybe we should, I'm gonna, I didn't look on the, I didn't really look around on there. It just, I just checked to see if there was uh, one in our area and there wasn't one, but I could always get online and um, at walmart.com and order it and have them deliver it to the store. I didn't think about that. I'll see about that, but um, yeah, we're ready to, we're ready to move. So that's exciting. Uh, let's see what else. Not much else. I'm just, I'm getting some good feedback um, on my little Christmas baubles, uh, and I did. I've got about twenty of them done, and they're so pretty. And uh, so we'll see how see how that goes. Next, I have to check YouTube videos and see how to make a clothes hanger Christmas tree because I'm thinking about making one of those and just hanging on them from it um, and I gotta do little tags to hang from them price tags but I'm thinking about doing a clothes hanger Christmas tree because I could kind of hook them all around there but I'm not sure I just have to see and I may find a, a wire frame Christmas tree that I like better, like at Garden Ridge or um, Brain Fart. One of these other places, home stores. So, yeah, I got to get this stuff together so that I can get it over there because nobody can buy it if it's sitting in my house. So, it's just pulling it all together right now I'm waiting for the bags as soon as I get the bags in um, I can take my bath salts and the bags um, over to the store and get those set up so that you know somebody could buy them if they wanted to um, did I say bath salts and cards bath salts and cards I don't even know what I'm saying anymore if I didn't, I meant bath salts and cards, and then the ornaments. I may just bag those and lay them down too for right now, just to get them there, and then worry about, you know, displaying them later. I'm not. I don't have a huge area to work with or anything. It's. It's not like he's giving me a. Uh, you know, he's. It's very generous what he's doing. I'm not saying that or complaining, but there's, you know, limited space. I've got a sore, I think i got a sty in my eye coming up, and I hate those things. My eye's sore right there, and in that corner, yeah. Y'all really want to watch me play with my eye. <laughs> anyway, so just playing today, running around playing, got got the shoes, and and it's really strange walking in them the first time, and I thought the little... Uh, I do not like toe socks. I don't like that in between the toe feeling. But really, these don't bother me. It's not that bad. And the material is really thin on, on this style anyway. So it really doesn't bother me. They make special socks that you can wear through them or wear with them. And there's netting on here. So um, in the winter time, you might need. A little bit of extra warmth on it now they they had a pair of leather ones that I really liked kind of suede black leather and um, they were hundred and twenty four dollars fifty four dollars hundred and twenty four yeah they may come later but this is a good thing to to find them on that good of a sale um, if you've never worn them that's pretty good uh, to see if you'd you'd like them, but I like them uh, so far so good. So anyway, the only part is they're kind of weird and kind of ugly. <laughs> but if they help my back and they help my hips, and um, I'm gonna I'm gonna give it a whirl. Uh, yeah, I guess that's it. And I'm about out of time anyway. I've kind of blithered on. So I'll talk to you guys later. Have a wonderful rest of your weekend. And I'll see you guys later.